Hello friends, welcome to another how-to. This one is all about my eyebrow routine. In case you're a ginger like me or you just want funny colored eyebrows. My eyebrows are blonde, super, super blonde. I grew them out for six weeks so I could show you how blonde they actually are. Thick eyebrows are in right now, right? Well, I got these thick, bushy eyebrows, but you can't see them. So I learned how to put makeup on my eyebrows. It takes forever and it takes a lot of artistry. And I don't know that I wanna sort of like set the bet of how my face looks in the morning based on like how artistic I'm feeling between my like first and second cups of coffee in the morning. So instead of taking 15 minutes every morning to make my eyebrows look flawless, why don't I take half an hour once every couple of weeks to make them look flawless every day and not have to worry about them in between. For shaping, I get my eyebrows threaded. There's a salon really close to my house and they do a really great job, it's super fast, and I don't have to inflict the excruciating pain on myself, rather a nice lady does it and it's over before you know it. That makes it a bit easier to put makeup on your brows because you're just trying to cover all the hairs that are left, but it gets more difficult over time as their eyebrow hairs grow in to discern where that awesome shape is. So here's what I look like with no makeup on, once I put my foundation on, I'm looking a little washed out. Let's finish up the rest of that makeup. And finally, the brows. I like to use the Anastasia Brow Wiz because it has like a spoolie on one end and then a twist up pencil on the other end. And it's available in some great shades for redheads. To dye my brows, I just use regular hair dye. I went for this root touch-up one because it's a nice small quantity. And I just use a small amount of each product and I mix it together in their little mixing tray. I know I'm not supposed to use actual hair dye on my eyebrows. I've seen folks use the Just For Men beard stuff because it doesn't have ammonia in it. And I've also had them use henna at the threading salon, which for me comes out a little bit dark. Just a disclaimer, I know this isn't recommended use of the product, and it's just what works for me. I'm using a wooden manicure stick to apply it and make sure it gets all the way down to the base of the hairs. And then I just clean up around the edges so it's not going to stain any skin. When the time is up, wipe off the color and then give your eyebrows a good wash with facial cleanser. So I hope this helped all you gingers out there. I know if I had learned this about my eyebrows maybe 10 years ago, I would have been a more happy, self-confident person. So if you're not a ginger, send this video to a ginger you love and give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I put out new how-tos on Mondays and vlogs on Thursdays. Bye. I wanna talk about makeup and not a new makeup look you can wear for a night out on the town, but everyday lady face, five minute, crush the patriarchy makeup routine for communication.